Hey guys, welcome. Hemil here. Okay, so what are we going to do today? So, as you may know, Griseo has finally come to Hong Kong back third. And. And. And I haven't set it up my stream actually. Sorry. Just give me a minute. Okay. And I haven't pulled for her, really. Um, that's because she's an SP support, if you must know. So if she's an SP support, that only means that she's here at the shop. In particular, um, this one. Oh, actually, she's available now. So I can actually try and go for her. How many did I got? I just I just need to wait for uh next next week and I'll be able to get her. I just need ten more. Oh, so she's a she's a she's a Sai. Okay, and there's also an event involving her, so yeah, we're going to be doing that right now. That's what we're going to do today. So, let's go.星空が消える場所から最も離れた古い森の中を Everyone's gone. The young painter was alone, suggesting that she had met with an accident on her travels. The paintbrush, the collars. Apparently, she even lost the paintbrush and paints that she always carried with her. Go find them. Unclear whether it was referring to her companions or her paintbrush, the young painter walked straight into the strange forest. There we go. The paintbrush is there. <laughs> but you already got the paintbrush on your hand, though. Found it. Hmm? You are... Oh, no. Is it someone living in this forest? Your color. Watch out! Who do we have? Kega wa nai daro ka, waga hime. Mr. Knight! Please stand behind me, I'll get rid of this threat immediately. I think I'm going to like Briseo. Wow, it's so pretty. Oh. Her weapon is also a cross size. You're safe, my princess. I've repelled all the assailants. You found me, Mr. Knight. Certainly it is my duty. 
The knight in azure armor is among the young painter's four companions. As a close friend, he was the first to join her journey. How did he find me? With this. The knight landed on one knee and gently held out one palm, revealing several paint tubes. My colors! Thank you for finding them. It's nothing. Please take good care of them. After we arrive in the town of Eternal Night and find the painting left by the depictor, they will surely be of service. I understand. The, o the, other are not, the others are not with you? Regrettably, the countess and the charioteer are not here. Did I... Did I read that right? Charioteer. Charioteer. You forgot the courtier. <laughs> it seems that the knight and the courtier are not, uh, are not that, uh, very amicable to each other. Yes, I'd like to forget that inept fellow. Don't get angry, Mr. Knight. Mr. Courtier doesn't mean harm. Your armor looks damaged. Must be the fighting. Pay it no mind. This dead cannot hinder me in the least. Let me fix it. My princess, colors are precious and you shouldn't be wasted on. Before the knight could protest any further, the young painter had grabbed the paintbrush and squeezed blue paint onto the palette. She loaded her paintbrush and painted on the broken armor. In no time, the damaged area was restored to its original shining glory. However, this also cost half of... Of blue paint in the tube. Done. Mr. Knight is radiating a pretty color again. I forgot you will not listen, but I'm very grateful all the same. Princess, I will not let you down. What should we do next? We must figure out where we are and then go find the other companions. Let's go. The Azure Knight lowered his head to so the young painter could ride on his broad shoulders. They ventured deeper into the forest. Oh. Before the dawn. Uh, this one is a new outfit for uh, Terry's Luna... Luna Kindred. You know, the one with... The vampire. There is a vampire. <laughs> Anyways. Right. Um, there's also a, a source event. We can actually also get her from here. Maybe I'll just wait until I, I could get it from here. Maybe. Okay, so... Uh, okay, so everything is still... What is this? All right, let's go. The young painter in the night walked and walked, and at last, Princess looked a village. The young painter looked in the direction the night pointed. The biggest trees had all been hollowed out, complete with eaves, which was a clear sign of being occupied just then. Who are you? Stop where you are. Hmm? You are? You're one of those enemies. Princess, please stand back. What are you, you trying to do? Us gardens aren't afraid of you. Mr. Nightweep, his color is suiting. He's not a bad guy. The knight nodded and sheathed his sword. We're friendly travelers passing by. May I ask if you live here? You're not the witch's underlings? You didn't come to abduct villagers? Witch? Abduct? You really aren't. <sighs> what a relief. Everyone, come out. They aren't bad guys. A rustling suddenly came from the 
from the seemingly unpeopled vicinity. Out of nowhere, a dozen figures gathered around the young painter in the night. How did so many people manage to hide? Don't be afraid, we peeps are born with the ability to blend into the color forests. Told you the witch wouldn't send a little girl over. Don't take him lightly. The big blue dude looks mean. Chief, what should we do with them? Ahem, we don't mean to scare you, travelers. We're a guardian clan that's been living here ever since the depictor created this lakeside forest. I'm the village chief, Blossom. These are... The forest dwellers who claim to be a guardian clan invited the young painter in the night into their village of three holes. Shortly afterwards, they served curious foods wrapped in large leaves. A stew made with mushrooms and herbal flowers and freshly picked berries. Guess from afar, help yourself. Is it really okay to trust them? We even brought them into our village. Relax, you gotta trust the judgment of a chief. How come a little girl like you became the chief? What? Why can't a little girl be a chief? Isn't the chief usually a wise and esteemed elder? Hmm, you think kids are dumb? Then why are you so differential to the kid right next to you? <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Knight is deferential to me? That's because I'm indebted to the princess, but you're right, I was too quick to judge. Please accept my apology. You must have contributed greatly to the village and the clan to be exceptionally selected as the chief. Um, I, uh, ha, that's a good one. There's no way this kid could have contributed greatly to our village. It's only because she's the little sister of the last chief. After she had gone missing, we didn't want to go through the trouble of election again, so we elected her instead. Cut it out! You! Get out and keep watch! I'll go now. Don't get mad, chief. Um, <clears throat> what's the missing chief case about? Actually, not long before your arrival, many villagers suddenly vanished, including my sister and the last chief, Garland. Vanished? Yes, her friends and family were gone in the blink of an eye. Ugh, they must be. They must have been magically abducted by that witch. The witch? Oh, a suspicious witch had visited our village before they vanished. She told us confusing things like, The serpent is unwilling to spew out the stars. And the world is fading and wanted us to go to her lakeside cabin. We didn't pay her any attention, which must have angered her, and now she's magically abducting our people. No. Yes, I beg your pardon. No, it's not her. We saw those people. The young painter shifted her gaze to the night, and it finally hit him. You're right. We saw the missing villagers. They... At that moment, Rush was interrupted the night. Ch chief Didn't I order you to stand sentry? Now's not the time! The missing villagers, they came back! What? Lead the way. Let's follow them, Mr. Knight. Yes. What? What happened to them? They won't talk, but they're still moving. Roar. Well, what do you want? Wake up. We're not your enemies. Mr. Knight. They're trying to attack again. Princess, please take cover. I'll do what I can to protect the villagers. Yo, big elf. You look like you need a hand. That this voice, a flexible figure darted out from the villagers and scurried to the young painter. Mr. Courtier! Oh! I... This is Mr. Courtier? Hello, princess, we meet again. Even the shipwreck cannot tear us apart, it seems. Cut the small talk if you want to help. That's why you're an oaf. How can the two of us possibly stop them? Tis a problem only a princess can solve. The courtier fished out several paint tubes from nowhere and shoved them into the young painter's hand. We're depending on you. Use the painting card to... To what? Oh, but where's Mr. Knight? Uh. 
Anyways, uh... Purple Iris. Traveler, the adventure has begun. Choose the painting cards you want to deploy. You can use the painting cards you just obtained. Okay. Tap here to deploy this painting card. Here are the deployed cards. Position represents. Different 1, 2, 3 are in front row and five, 4, 5 are in the back row. The cards position battles are shown. The numbers and position... The numbers and position of cards from both sides can respond to each other. Pay attention to this as enemies will appear on the right, where the arrow is pointing to. Dear Traveler, remember this and ready to go. Let's borrow the powers of the painting mouse to begin. Wait, 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 wait. I haven't set it up anything. No. Oh, okay. Let's put him on the second one for the very, for the very front. All right, let's do this battle. No, oh, I can, I can only watch. I can't do anything. After ultimate SP is fully charged, tap on the avatar to unleash a corresponding painting card ultimate. Some painting card skills deal elemental damage, and the elemental identifier will appear when elemental damage is dealt. What elemental damage? I don't see any elemental damage. Success. The young painter painted weapons and armors to armor companions and the villagers. With her timely help, they managed to push the berserk guardians back. I is this some kind of magic? Ah, oh, wait, don't go! Having lost the battle, the berserk guardians turned around, became transparent, and fled into the forest. Turns out the missing villagers weren't abducted by magic, but sneaked out of the village with camouflage. But why would they do that? And they had the strangest look on their faces as if their souls were siphoned. The witch put a spell on them. My sister wasn't among them. We need to find them. Chief, not so fast. If we all leave, there will be no one left to protect the village. Then you all stay. I'll go alone. You can't do it yourself. Someone help me grab her. Chief, hold on. How about we... The villagers huddled around the young chief and whispered for a while. Then the girl, having made up her mind, walked up to the young painter. The traveling painter, I have a request, and I hope you will accept it. Okay, let's go. Understandable, as it's very difficult- Wait, what? I haven't said anything yet! Come on, anyone would have guessed you want them to help you find your sister and the missing villagers. Really? Do you really mean it? Yeah, because you treated us to vibrantly colored foods. Indeed. To we traveler, few favors are as generous as providing board and lodging, so we must repay it. Besides, we can't travel safely with berserkers wandering in the forest. That sums it up. Can we get going? Oh, in that case, please bring along a villager as a guide. Okay. Use a painting purple iris during during the what? Duplicates will be converted to you. Okay. So this is a purple. We obtained a new painting card again. Let's see how we can enhance our painting cards from the album. Uh, we also gain painting card experience from the previous battle. Tap here to level up your painting card. Tap here to select another painting card. Oh, we got... <laughs> we get to use... Uh, <laughs> Kalin. 
This baby mm, level up this baby card too. The most resourceful way of increasing your combat power is to evenly level up your painting cards. You can view the various professions of the painting cards here. They include tank, DPS, support, and assassin. Here you can check the detailed stats of the painting cards. Tap here to see the painting card's talents. Painting cards have two talent skills each, basic attack and ultimate. You can star up your cards to learn new talents. So this one... What is this? A tank? No, a damage dealer, I guess. This one is probably the tank. Uh, this one is damage dealer. This one is probably assassin from the looks of it. This one is probably a uh, mage. Yeah, so we only have... Range physical DPS. Single target melee DPS. Oh, so... So this one is actually called DPS. This one is tank. Uh... What were the others? I guess I'll I'll find out later. Journey of Painting Dreams Emblem. Okay. We obtain a new painting card. Let's coordinate the lineup. Here is a new painting card. It's a range card, so let's put it in the back row. Do you still remember one, two, three are in front row and Four or five are the back row. Let's try it out. Battle. We don't really have to do anything but watch it. Oh, there is actually a... Tap this button to begin auto battle. Painting cards will unleash ultimate automatically once ultimate SP is fully charged. Tap again to cancel auto battle. Tap this button to activate the speed up function. The battle speed will be increased to times to two times. Tap again to revert to one, two times one. There are type counters between painting cards. Bio, side. Bio counter Psy, Psy counters Meg, Meg counters Bio, and Qua counters Qua. Oh, it's just the usual one. When a painting card type counters enemies, the damage numbers will appear yellow. Okay, we got another one. No painting card dies. The witch's cabin, the first color. Support! Oh, there is DPS and now we have a support. Uh, let's level her up. Mm. Wait, where do we put the support? It's supposed to be at the back, right? They need to be protected. Tink, tink. Assassin. Right, so we have DPS, support, tank, and assassin. Hmm. 
We will get another one. Her ultimate can restore HP for the team and is also ranged. Remember to station her in the back row. What is this? Upgrade... Oh. Okay. Oh no. I need, he needs heal, he needs heal, come on, support. Okay. So we got a tank. Right. Oh, all right. I can just go for another one. Oh, wait. So this is no longer a... Uh... So this is an actual battle. Elysian Astra, heart's color. Cezanne. Did I... did I... is that right? Cezanne or is it Cezanne? Starry impression. And so, to find the rest of the guardians, the young painter and companion and company ventured deeper into the forest in the direction of the lake. Ah, <sighs> I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Don't lose hope. Where there is a will, there is a way. I didn't. Ex I didn't expect. Except. Except or expect. <laughs> <laughs> it's supposed to be expect, right? I didn't expect the chief herself to be our guide, though. In terms of knowledge of the forest, even the older generations aren't my match. And I can't sit still in the, at the thought of finding my sister. Do you like your sister a lot? Well, she's not only a reliable chief, but also a loving sister. She's been showing me every corner of the forest since I was a child. Once we went too deep into the forest and stumbled across a beast's den... She hurt her right wing to protect me, which hasn't fully healed even after I grew up. She was kind to every villager, not just me. They made me chief because they're grateful to her. The young painter walked up to the girl and stroked her with a hand. Traveling painter. Sad color. Bad. Huh? She's comforting you. Oh, thank you. Ahem, <clears throat> you must be tired from walking like me, so why don't we camp over there? The young painter and company camped in the forest clearing. The courtier deftly pulled the tent out of his bag and set it up with the night. He then lighted a fire with the branches he collected. When the forest sat around the campfire, they noticed something. There is no night here too? Yes, at least one day and a half has passed since we reunited, but it's still day. Something's definitely going on in Starry Night Town, the town of eternal night. Travelers, could it be that you know why the sky stopped darkening? Of course. Do you know why the world has day and night? Yep, my sister told me that when I was young, far, far away from our forest is a town without day where a serpent lives. The serpent would swallow the night and the stars so dawn could break everywhere else. Does that mean... The serpent may have a problem that prevents night from falling. Young lady, have you heard of the tale of the depictor? Everyone knows the depictor is the legendary painter. She painted everything in our world with her paintbrush and paint. And she disappeared after arriving in Starry Night Town. It's said she painted the law of day-night cycle there. 
If this law goes wrong, it can only be restored by paintbrush and paint. The knight in the courtyard looked at the young painter who was warming her hands over the campfire. Star Knight Town must go, confirmed the colors. The colors left by the depictor. I see, traveling painter, you're heading to a faraway place. Going there wouldn't be so much of a bother if we knew where it is. We just follow any trail we can find. Hmph. <laughs> You're still mad at me? Seriously? I only brought the ship about because this forest looked mysterious enough to hold the picture's secrets. Who'd have thought we'd run into a storm that sank our ship, separated our gang, and put the princess in danger? Um, uh, look on the bright side. We reunited with the princess safely, so logically speaking, the very evil countess and charioteer should be alive and kicking somewhere. Is your sloppiness a Foolish ideas that have plunged us into danger time and again. C calm down, don't fight. Mr. Knight, don't get mad. I agree with Mr. Courtier on this. Did you hear what the princess said? Princess, you're going to spoil him. Our situation is grim, particularly considering that you use a lot of paint to fend off the crazed villagers. Paint? Is that important to you? Hmm? Paint, colors, very important. That's easy. We can pick some flowers in the forest to make it. Making paint from flowers? My sister told me that long ago another traveling painter entered the forest and made paints of many colors from the local flowers. Oh, but not every flower will do. My sister taught me how to identify them. If you want, I can take you to where the flowers are. Take us there. It'd be even better if we could replenish paint. Hey, bro, it's getting better. You obviously didn't learn the lesson. Well, then everyone follow me. Oh, just a minute. Okay, where were we? Um... Ah, it's here. This flower bush here. Vivid Crimson Fire, Warrant, Passion. There are a few here, too. Refreshing Yellow, Sunlight Breeze, Companion. Oh, no. Eh? What's this? Looks like a door. This wasn't here last time. Let's stay away from it. No, we can't. That's, uh, that's Elise. That's the Elysian realm's, uh, domain. Suddenly, the gap that resembled the door quickly widened burst and like swallowing it. Princess, are you alright? I'm fine. This is. We were just in the forest. What happened? Anyway, we can only walk around and see. The colors here. Oh, this is the one that. Yeah. The colors. Wow, something just appeared. Oh no. Don't panic. Fight alongside me. Look, that is the same door again. Just a minute. Um, uh, new splash. There's something just suddenly happened. Um, my internet suddenly disappeared, so. So I am not sure if this would go through. Light burst forth once more. The young painter waited until it died down before opening her eyes and looked around. We're back. <clears throat> and we bear good news. As weird as that place is, it's got an exit. 
I don't know what's going on, but at least we're back in the forest. Something soft. This isn't where we picked flowers just now. Ah, uh, it really isn't. Give me a minute to recognize which part of the forest this is. There is a cabin over there. The cabin? What? What's the problem? Stop being so jumpy. You're scaring me. This is... This is... The witch's cabin. Uh, uh, right. Right, because uh, my internet suddenly got cut off. Uh, yeah, so, um, afraid to say. I uh, so, yeah, I suppose I could only say that I'll have to uh, end it here and uh, continue on in the next video. Uh, why, why did this, what is this, this suddenly happened? Okay, I'll I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.